A very special thank you to the EA Creator Network for inviting me out to capture some early footage of Apex Legends Season 11. Yeah, what's going on guys? Welcome back for some more Apex Legends. Today we get our very first look at Season 11, the brand new map, and the brand new legend coming to the game, Ash, who you are looking at in the background right now, uh, as well as that little prowler, man. Yo, the new map got a ton of wildlife in it, dude. It's, it's, it's a lively map. Tons of colors, tons of cool things to look at, and lots of wildlife. Uh, you, I'm sure you guys know what a flyer is. We've seen flyers before. Uh, there's flyers on the map, and then they added prowler dens, so you're gonna see prowlers roaming around the map, you can shoot the prowlers, they level up your evo shield a little bit to a certain degree, and they drop a lot of loot. So there's many good reasons to take on the prowlers when you see them, but the prowlers aren't the only thing that you can take on. When you're walking around and you see these spider eggs and you want to take on the spiders, all you need to do is shoot the spider eggs and out come a bunch of spiders. You take them on, they'll drop a ton of good loot, and you can level up your evo shield. So there's many good reasons to take on the wildlife on the map, and we can make an entire video based around all the new things on the map. It's just so much to go over, man. But today, I want to focus on the newest legend added to the game, Ash. okay? She is absolutely incredible, and I do have some gameplay using her, but before we get into the games, I want to hop into the range, and I want to show off her kit, okay? So I want to talk about her abilities, starting off with her tactical ability, the Arc Snare. So when you throw the Arc Snare at an enemy, you're going to hit him for a whopping 20 damage right off the rip, but that's not the big one, okay? That's not the big one. You're going to notice a ring around the enemy, and they're going to be attached to that ring, and when they try to leave that ring, they're going to get pulled back there's going to be resistance there because it's a tether okay so basically it's trying to keep you in that ring and i can understand that it's it's kind of hard to see right it's more of a feel than a see so i want to show you guys what it looks like when there's an octane jump pad in the middle of this and you're trying to pad out as octane watch what happens you, you see this it's it's really strong man so uh think of it as like uh like a mini horizon alt almost in, in a way because once you once you get past that first initial pull it can't do it a second time so if you hypothetically if you try to hit the jump pad twice it'll only pull you on the first one the second one isn't going to be as strong so uh pretty crazy when you see it like that it's it's much more noticeable i guess and if you wanted to see it from the perspective of the Octane, this is what it looks like. So, uh, you just hit the pad one time and it stops you in your tracks. But once you break that tether the first time, it doesn't affect the second pad. So, uh, it doesn't feel too, too bad. But even stimming out of it, man, it, it, you can notice it, you know? <laughs> it's pretty crazy. So, uh, that is her tactical ability. Really good. Definitely really good. And her ultimate, I would say, is even better. Okay? She is going to be a very good legend. Check out her ultimate. Think of it as a one-way wraith portal. So you swing the sword and it by the way, animation looks incredible. Like it, This looks really, really cool, but you can't go back. So once you and your team take this portal, or maybe an enemy takes it to chase after you, you can't take it back. So it's different from a Wraith portal in the sense that a Wraith portal can be used defensively if, oh no, this was a bad portal, can't go here, uh, just take it back, you can't do that, okay? There's no back and forth, one way only, and uh, she's really, really cool. Now, for her passive, I'm gonna have to show you that in-game while we're playing because I can't show you that one in the range. So it's called Marked for Death. And basically what it allows you to do is go over to the death box of a, a downed player in the middle of a game and you can ping that death box and it will tell you where the team is that killed that person, okay? So let's say somebody knocks your teammate, your teammate gets down and thirsted and you're just around the corner going to grab banner and you pick up that banner, you can ping your teammate's death box and you can find out where that team is that killed your teammate. You can also do it to enemy death boxes too so if you're running around and you see death boxes on the ground you can ping those death boxes and you can see where the enemy is so really really cool idea i dig it i think it's gonna be a lot of fun for uh for aggressive players and players that are seeking constant action it's gonna be cool man so that's ash that's all of her abilities and my first impressions are it, she's insane i think her kit is absolutely incredible and i think her ultimate especially is going to make for some nutty plays man i can't wait to play her more myself to make some cool plays with her ult but I also can't wait to see what other people are going to be able to do. Like, you can you can make some pretty creative plays with her ult and outplay some enemies offensively and defensively. I think uh, the, the sky's the limit with Ash, and I think she's going to be a wild popular legend this season. Uh, not just because she's going to be really good. She's, she's strong. Trust me, she is strong, and I, I just think her character as a whole is really cool too. She is 
going to be very popular and I think everybody should be excited for some more Ash, man. She is, she's really, really cool. So speaking of being excited for Ash, uh, it's time to get in some gameplay, all right? So I have a game to share with you guys where I was able to play some Ash and uh, use her abilities in the middle of fights and all that stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you so very much for watching and I will see you guys tomorrow for some more Apex Legends. Uh, someone's aiming at me. Oh! It's kind of our time, baby. Out. I'm sorry, fellas. I didn't Drag realize out. you were right there. Out of. Enemy down. Reloading. I'm under fire. Oh, you are dead. You're a gunner. Dude, I wonder if you if you'd be able to like put her portal in the air. Like that would be kind of crazy. That'd be kind of crazy. Good job. Thank you. Moving here. I wonder who that bloodhound was actually. He, that bloodhound seemed to have like really really good movement. We got we got to get the number down. <laughs> I got I to see who this was after. So we don't actually get to play with our names, so we don't actually know, but. I got a feeling that, that that's got to be one of the friends, for sure. Alright, so these are the spiders, okay? So these are the eggs on the walls. Spider and here. if you shoot them, spiders will come up. Okay, he shot it. That's cool. So they're pretty easy to kill. They're not hard. But I think the the worst case scenario of what could possibly happen when you're when you're doing the spiders, I guess, is Spider people will hear your gunshots and you could get pushed. Like you could get caught with your pants down real quick. But I would say it's worth it. Spider eggs here. I would say it's worth it. Cause I'm getting good attachments. I got purple barrel staves. They drop ammo, so like you just replenish the ammo. There's a purple stalk right there. Like, it's just wonderful. All right, let us move down. I feel like after shooting those spiders, we had to have drawn the attention of somebody. Somebody had to have heard us. Let's take a peek. Oh, right there. There we go. <laughs> Called it. Well, you shot a little prematurely there, I think, but that's cool. Are right, we gonna get rid of that pad? Now that guy's split, and I'm kind of hoping the Octane walks up, because maybe maybe we'd be able to focus him. Eliminate the enemy. Did you? Oh look, that's the that's the the Ash. That's the Ash portal. Recharging shields. Oh, they're getting shot from above. <laughs> Got him. I think he stuck him in the forehead. Recharging shields. <laughs> Reloading. I kind of want to kill the team above. Damn, no light ammo. I kind of want to kill the team above. Uh oh. Oh, say no more. We're going in. So sick, dude. So sick. Nice shots from the teammate, man. Let's go. Oh boy, I want to get up close to somebody so I can use this car. Alright, these guys going to gatekeep us or what's the deal here? They're moving. 
Wait, they're getting shot at too. There's a lot of different teams here. Okay. I'm so sorry. Cut down an enemy. Oh man, the car recoil is tricky to get used to. It's, I can't use that at range, man. It's so tricky. Throw one on the other hand, though. Reloading. Cut down an enemy. Enemy taken out. All right, he is getting away. Let's get a little bit of light ammo. Nice. Reloading. Oh, we, we can ping the we can ping the death box. It'll show us where that wraith is. Pinpointed the targets. Don't let them escape. There we go. He's right around this wall. Let's take this portal. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, what is this? Okay. Shields are depleted. I, I I think the portal disappeared when I was in it. I think that's what happened. Okay, so one thing I'm learning with the car is the recoil is not that bad until you get about halfway through the mag. Halfway through the mag, and then it just gets western on you. Okay, we have survived, fellas. Let's go. Nice job, boys. Let's mosey on into the beach. I like this side of the map, dude. The oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, no, no. Uh oh. This is free kills if they walk up. Wait! These the oh, no. Uh oh. Oh, that was literally free if they walked, but they used the, the ash thing. Oh, Watson, come up top with me. Watson, come up top with me. Come, come. Oh, no. Oh! Wait, maybe the car recoil not that bad. Maybe it's not that bad. What in the hell? What are you doing, Rampart? I'm out of light ammo. I secured the banner. Do you have light ammo? Second chance. Yes, you do. Thank you. Wait, I should be able to ping teammates' death box. Let's see where they are. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pinpointed our marks. Okay. Oh God, no. Thirty seconds. Arbor, Arbor. <laughs> no, it's too much. It's too much. They had the jump pad, man. They had the jump pad. Damn, that was so sick, though, man. First, first round, going with Ash, and uh, I think we did pretty good, man. We got to use our abilities. We, we tethered a couple people. Used the ultimate. Use the ultimate pretty effectively too. When we when we went up that like that high ground area, that was sick, dude. This en this end screen is really cool. I love the lighting, man. Oh, this map is amazing. This is so much fun. Hey, right, not bad, not bad. Let's go, dude.